Hello, welcome back to another episode of the GeoGuessr Daily Challenge. Um, I have a recall in my mouth. I hope it's not annoying to you, but I need it. My throat is in a lot of pain. I'm just sore. Just a sore throat. Okay, but here we are. It's looking tropical. We seem to be walking. Um, possibility of Costa Rica. I believe there was Spanish on the sign, although I have forgotten already. Um... The reason I say Costa Rica, though, is because in Costa Rica, we walk. It's just how things work. Thank you. Just got a water delivery. Because I can't leave my room, obviously. Um, anyway, University of Costa Rica campus is where we are. So... Probably in San Jose. Let's just look for a university. I see that, but that's not it. Ah. Yeah, we're probably in here somewhere. I'm going to go place it. Oh, we were actually a lot closer. University of Costa Rica, Rodrigo Facio campus. We weren't up there. Not too bad, though. All right. This looks very familiar, although a lot of rounds look like this. Feels almost Russian, Latvian, Lithuanian. The Baltic area could even be Poland. So let's keep going. Roads are in pretty bad shape. And yes, so that's a Russian sign there, I believe. Is this a P? I think it is. Plodosovkos. Plodosovkos or something like that. I think I'm pretty close. Plodosovkos. I mean, we're probably not going to find that, but I'll put a sign. I'll put a... Sorry. I'll put a, a little guess down right next to Moscow Kamenka probably just means bridge don't know um do I think it's Russia I mean this has a Stoyan Stoyanka probably not the name of a place I think it's Russia I don't think it's gonna be Ukraine However, I do feel, out of all things, that this might not be a great round. Let's hope that this intersection here has some good signs, because if not, we could be in trouble. Yeah, looks like we have some signs. Possibly. It's a huge intersection. We need some sort of signage. Okay. Kameno. Kamenoe. I think that one's just phonetic. I mean, it's a huge intersection for a whole lot of nothing, though. That's the problem. Um, where in Russia do I think we are? I guess is the question. Probably down here. Um, PLO was the start of the name of the place that we found. Um, but I'm not ready yet, honestly. To make my guess. I'm a little bit worried. However, based on how it looks, looking like, you know, many areas of Lithuania and Latvia look, um, it does make me want to guess over there. We're not going to find anything else, so maybe we're better off if we just place a guess in here. This is going to be wrong. Maybe a little bit further south. Yeah, fingers crossed, but it's going to be bad. Yep. <coughs> yeah, that's a tough one. That's a tough one. Nothing we could do on that. I'll say right off the bat, nothing we could do. This guy somehow knew. But I didn't. Kamino is there. Maybe there's a sign that said Chelyabinsk, one that said Kurgan. Could not find it. Apologies for the coughing. 
All right, silver. We're in silver territory. Um, syrup. Wooded path through the trees. We have these bollards with a red thing in it. Black top. Don't know what that means necessarily. Um. License plates. I didn't check on the cars. Oh. Could these be the Austrian bollards? Is that a possibility? Now this looks like a vineyard we're coming up on though. Right? Maybe not. Maybe. Ugh. Never, never crunch on one of those. Oh, it tastes awful. Ugh. Well, that's really bad. I don't even have water. It's outside my door. Ugh. Yo, that is awful. Yeah, it's German. We're in Austria. Probably around here. Um, why do I say around there? I have no idea. 100% I guess. I have actually no logic to back it up. Um, snack truck. That's cool. I've never seen a snack truck before. Looks like we're not going to be able to read it very well. Uh, this truck, where are you going, sir? Punti Gamer. Gamer truck. Alright, not good. No info. I mean, worse comes to worst. We're in Switzerland, but we're very close either way. Uh, here we go. Ebersdorf is a place. This sign is almost certainly going to say the same. It does. Eversdorf, huh? I don't know. There's not much. There's a dwarf. There's not much coverage in um, Austria to begin with, right? As far as I'm aware, there isn't. Which makes me think. Could we be on the, uh, you know, Swiss side of things? I don't know. But I'm encouraged by the dwarf that I'm seeing. I mean, it also could be Germany straight up. Even though there's not much German coverage. Um, and by coverage, I mean like Google Photos taken in that location. Uh, the Google uh, Street View. Uh, wonderful. Yeah, we were far again. Uh, not great today so far. Not great. Not on my game. Alright. Here we are, fourth round. Um, so we're in a Spanish-speaking country. Just kind of looking for clues on which country we could be in. It feels more Mexican or Guatemalan than anything else to me. Um, like a Central American type of vibe rather than a South American type of vibe. Uh, but I could be wrong, of course. That's why we continue searching. Uh, yeah, because it says Bolivia right there and Santa Cruz. So there you go. That shows you that I was 100% wrong. Um, but yeah, here we are. We're in Santa Cruz de la Sierra. Uh, where? Ceresi, maybe? Or that could just stand for something around Santa Cruz. I'm not really sure. Um, number 1431. I mean, we're seeing... No, that doesn't help. I don't think we're very close to the center, if you can tell by how it looks. Um, so if that's the case, then we're, we are by a town square, which is not anything really shocking. Hmm. Things are starting to get a little more developed towards this direction. Which makes me think we are on the western side of town. Um, maybe around here. I'm actually going to place a guess. 
Let's see. All right. Santa Cruz being the region, not the city, of course, is always a possibility. We were out here in Montero. Yeah, which makes sense because it didn't look like we were in a city. So that's why I wanted to place on the outskirts. But obviously, I don't think that would have been far enough to not see larger buildings in the distance. Anyway, uh, we're at an Etihad racetrack. So probably Saudi Arabia, if I had any guess. And bad. Don't know what that means. But yeah, Etihad is a Saudi... Um... Correct me if I'm wrong, they might be Saudi. I think they're Saudi, not Qatari. Uh, Saudi uh, plane or oil or something. I don't know. Uh, airline oil. I don't know. All I know is they fund Manchester City with their billions and billions of dollars. That's all I know. Uh, anyway. Could we be in Riyadh? I don't know. I mean, that's not really a country that ever comes up. This could also be a case of, you know, a stadium in an area that we are not in that um, country. Yas Marina, Y-A-S Marina Circuit, right? Um, yeah, and Etihad, I mean, I'm not seeing the sponsorships anymore, which means we might actually just be somewhere else entirely it does say yas marina we do have arabic writing i mean we could be anywhere in the world considering this is a photosphere and not necessarily a you know um actual street footage um what, what am i doing um maybe we find a racetrack in here that would be kind of cool. <clears throat> I don't really watch racing. Um, what is this Formula One track? Um, okay, well, I'm not seeing anything, but maybe this is a possibility. I uh, can't say for sure. In bad. A D N B A D and Etihad is right at the start. N B A D <clears throat> B A Bahrain. No, I don't think so. Damn, this is the thing about racetracks. Oh, there's the Y A S as well. It's not. It's not Y for Yemen. It's not A for... Ar it could be Arabia. What does that say? I don't know. I don't think it's going to be Riyadh. Let's just find out. This is it's just fun. Uh, Abu Dhabi. A, D, bad. B yeah. A, D, A, D, Abu Dhabi. That makes sense. That's a tough one. I'm sure... This guy's a racing fan. He, he would know probably where it is. Uh, if not, it's hard to guess. Uh, but anyway, really poor game today. 18,096 is our score. Um, can't have great games every single day, unfortunately. Um, despite that. Uh, I was going to say maybe we made top 50. Top 62. It's pretty early on. Not looking great for my... <laughs> For my leaderboard standings today. Anyway, that's going to do it. So if you enjoyed, please leave a like down below. Subscribe for daily GeoGuessr videos. And leave a comment. Let me know how you did on this daily. Um, maybe you beat me. You probably did. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.